I'd like to introduce Judy Gorman, who's a singer-songwriter from Brooklyn. She performs throughout the USA. She's bringing down the house already. <laughs> She's a member of Local 1000, and here she is. Give her a big welcome. Spent my whole life making somebody rich. I busted my ass for that son of a bitch and he, he left me to die like a dog in a ditch and he told me I'm all used up he used up my labor he used up my time he plundered my body he squandered my mind he left me a pension of handouts and wine he told me I'm all used up my kids are in hock to a god you call work Slaving their lives out For some other jerk My youngest in Frisco Just made shipping clerk And he don't know I'm all used up Some people reach it For power and gold They don't have respect For anything old For pennies they're bought for promises sold, someday they'll be all used up. They use up the oil and they use up the trees, use up the air and they use up the seas. Well, how about you, friend? How about me? What's left when we're all used up? I'll live out my life in this crummy hole. But my plumbing still works I'm clear as a bell No, I'm not all used up Outside my window The world passes by And it gives me a handout Spits in my eye And no one can tell me Cause no one knows why I'm living if I'm all used up Sometimes And they don't think I'm all used up There's songs and laughter, things I can do And all that I've learned, I'd give back to you And I'd give my last breath just to make it come true No, I'm not all used up the shop with you, you gotta build your union, you gotta make it strong, and if you all stick together, well, it won't be long, you get shorter hours, higher wages, better working conditions, vacations with pay, take your kids to the seashore. It ain't quite that simple, so I better explain just why you've got to ride on the union train, because if you wait for the boss to raise your pay, you'll all be waiting till judgment day, you'll all be buried, gone to heaven, and saying, be to be the straw boss then. Now you know you're underpaid, but the boss says you ain't, and he speeds up the work till you're about to faint, you ain't be down and out, but you ain't beaten, you can pass out a Legally, you can call a meeting and talk it over. Speak your mind. Decide to do something about it. Now the boss may persuade some poor damn fool to go to your meeting and act like a stool, but you can always sell a stool, though that's a fact. Got a coward streak running down his back. He doesn't have to stool. He'll always get along, though, and he steals out of blind men's cups. You got a union now, and you're sitting pretty. You put some of the folks on the steering committee because the boss won't listen when just one squawks, but he's got to listen when the union talks. He'd better be mighty lonesome. Everybody decide to walk out on him. Suppose they're working you so hard that it's just outrageous and they're paying you all starvation wages while you go to the boss and the boss will yell before I raise your pay I see you all in hell. Smoking a big cigar, feeling mighty slick cause he thinks he's got your union lick. Till he looks out the window, what does he see? A thousand bigots and they all agree he's a bastard. Slave driver, Betty beats his wife. 
Now here you come to the hardest time because the boss will try to bust your picket line. He will raise your meeting, hit you on the head, call every one of you a goddamn red on patriotic. Evil doers, terrorists, sabotaging the national homeland security. But let me tell you, here in Washington, here's what they found all over this country. Here's what they found all over the world. Here's what they found. That if you don't let red bait break you up, and if you don't let race hatred break you up, and if you don't let sexism break you up, or homophobia break you up, or vigilantes break you up, or stool pigeons break you up, or fear break you up, you will win. What I mean is, take it easy, but take it. Pretty good.